unique feature of Maputnik is that you can style GeoJSON sources directly. So we can copy a link to a GeoJSON file. This could even be in your internal network. Here we will use the natural earth ocean polygons. We go to Maputnik and add a new source. And we will choose GeoJSON source, give it the name ocean and add the link. Let's add that source. Let's add another one like the populated places that shows all cities. Let's copy this link, go to Maputnik and add it as another GeoJSON source. Let's call this one populated places. Add the source. Now we're added our data sources. So let's inspect the data to see what we've got here. So we got the big ocean polygons here and all these dots are the populated places. So let's create a layer for that. Let's go into map mode again, add a layer. Let's first just create the background layer. Good. Now let's add another layer where we will choose the ocean. Let's give it the name water and we will use the ocean source and it will be a fill layer and let's give it a blue color. Oops, that was the background. Let's give that one a blue color. Nice. Now, if we inspect it, we see for the populated places, we have a property called name that we can use for styling. But first we're just going to use a circle layer. So we will choose circle, use the populated places and give it the name places. We add the layer and here we have our populated places. Now let's turn that into a symbol layer and we will choose the name as text field. So this takes a moment and let's decrease the size to 12. And here we have all our populated places. Let's give it a little halo. And that's how you style it with GeoJSON sources. Now I can download my style. And here we see we have our GeoJSON sources and our styled layers. And now you can easily publish that as your own map. And you don't need any server, you can use the GeoJSON file that you host via HTTP. And that's a unique feature of Maputnik. Thanks for watching.